Good evening, and welcome to Weirdo Rama. I am your host, Victor von Psychotron, and all of us at Weirdo Rama will always strive to bring you the creepy, <laughs> congratulations, the strange. And, of course, the weird. You mean it? I do, T. I'm willing to do anything you ask. Really? I owe that much. Tonight, we have a martial arts film for you. Sister Street Fighter. Starring none other than Etsuo Shiomi and Sonny Chiba. So, lock all of your doors and windows. Turn off all of your lights. Sit back, have a cup of tea, and enjoy tonight's film, Sister Street Fighter. But first, a short film. Three man close quarter comite. Mr. Boyajian, Mr. Corral, Mr. Bonadetto, up here. All right, Kielski. Thank you. 
Nothing else in front of you. Nothing should be in your mind but a light bulb. Everything else blank out. Blank out. Just that light bulb. Relax. Hands at sides. Mukto position. Two minutes. Two minutes. Mr. Bandaro. Mr. Hefman. Over here. Hey, sharp kicks.
Today, Lee Long, the top champion of the Shirinji School of Martial Arts, was reported missing. The champion's sister, Tina, has been called to Hong Kong Police Headquarters. Miss Long, listen to me. Your brother Lee was our agent. I ordered him to infiltrate a ring of dope smugglers. He's disappeared. Is he dead? We don't know. Your brother Lee was our best agent. That's why we assigned him to the case. We had to use a man of Lee's caliber. His mission was to investigate Central Export. Central Export? Your brother is a man of great courage. He has faced the best. However, all of these are murderers. And who are these killers? The professional karate fighters who work for Central. A dummy company whose real trade is in drugs. Another agent was working with your brother. A young lady. She's also disappeared. They both failed to report. If we can find her, she can lead us to your brother and help to break up the ring. Your help is needed as well. If you agree, I must tell you that it's dangerous and you'll be risking your life. For your brother's sake, you'll help us, I'm sure. Those monsters have got to be stopped. We all know the dreadful results of addiction to drugs. Help us and we'll stop their dealing in it. You'll have no choice if you love your brother. Will you agree to help us? Our undercover agent's name is Fanny Singer. And your point of contact in Yokohama is the Club Mandarin. She works there as an exotic dancer. You'll recognize her by a red rose. Meet her at 8 o'clock. Spaghetti with chili. Hello, Kitty. I know what you need. We can take care of it. Shut up. Oh. You little bitch. woman in karate. And karate builds an appetite. So, eat up. Thank Go you. ahead. My, it's good to see you here. I hardly knew you. You were only a child. Now you're a lady. You know, you're well known in Japan now. A real celebrity. Tina, would you instruct me in the martial arts? Why, Randy, I think amateurs like you better take sewing classes. Now, cut it out. You're behaving like babies again. There's no hope for these two kids here. <laughs> the brother is worse than his sister. 
your own brother fought with you, you recall. <laughs> will they find him, his brother? I promise we'll find Lee Long. Yes, we'll find him. I've searched and will continue with the search, Tina. We must never abandon the search. He's all right, Uncle. He's a true champion and a great force. He's fought for good since he was a boy. His causes have always been just. He's alive, I know it. And I'll find him and bring him back. <laughs> could walk out of us. We got the goods on you. You're a police spot. Move.
are no excuses. You'll have to get away. You stupid idiots. If you don't kill her before I tell the boss, he'll kill you. Lilo sisters in Tokyo. Her brother belongs to the Shirinji School of Martial Arts. He may get into the act yet, eh? His pupils are strong and fearless. One of them may have rescued Fanny Singer. Uh, hammerhead. Enough. <clears throat> so, you screwed up once again. As usual, you should have let me handle the bell. Your only desire is to destroy the Shorinji and its followers. It's too dangerous. You're right. I have only one aim in life, as you say. Get rid of that school forever, and nobody could stop me from carrying out that plan. The Shorinji school will die. There is only room for one true champion. You'll have your choice. It's your neck if you fail. Go to the Shorinji school today. Find out whatever you can. The ideal of the Shorinji school is the unity of power and love. Shorinji is the embodiment of physical strength and Zen spirit. Defense of the self is secondary. Your physical power and the power to love are one and the same. To love is the true goal. We must find our true selves in ourselves and in others. Share our joys and our sorrows will be lessened. Harmony between yourself and others is the basic condition of the karate fighter. And harmony is based on concessions and the laws of karma. As you cause suffering, so shall you suffer. The law of retribution is inviolable. In the conduct of our exercises, let us cultivate a spirit of compromise and mutual respect. This is the message and the spirit of Shorinji. Ah! Right. First exercise, go! Ah! It's this ah! ah! She go! Ah! Look it! It's me! Ah! Oh, see! Ah! Go, look! Ah! It hurts! Ah! Ah! Like this. Long sister. She's come here? Yes, ma'am. Hmm. So, your brother Lee was a narcotics agent, and he was on assignment when he disappeared. Is that right? Yes, sir. Miss Lee, there are those who say that your brother himself was addicted to drugs and that he was working for the smugglers. I know better, sir. Mm. Yes, we both know your brother would never take dope. I love Lee Long. My ideals and his were as one in karate. Yes, I loved your brother. On the day Lee Long disappeared, he was selected as Shirinji's greatest teacher of martial arts. He was to represent us in the martial arts championships. The last time I saw him, we talked about you. 
He hoped that you would get married soon and lead a life of peace and contentment. He cared very deeply for you. Then you agree to help me find him, won't you? My life is yours. We'll do all we can. Are the police doing anything? Yes. The police said that it will all depend on me. I must get them proof. Tina Long, do not worry. I give you my word, we'll fight for you. All my pupils are your men. The entire school will help. Right. We will find your brother alive. That is certain. We have a girl in the school. She is young, but she is most expert in the martial arts. Her name is Emmy Kawasaki. She is your age. I think you'll get on well. Who's that? That man there? Sonny Hibachi. He's a teacher of karate. His father was one of our greatest champions, a karate genius. Sonny is captain of the university karate team. He is a racing driver as well. A very good man with an unusual personality. He's very much an individualist, a fascinating person. At any rate, from now on, he is your man. I mean, he will assist you in any way you need him. You're tired. That's enough for the day. I thank you, Master. Sonny! Meet the sister of Lee Long. Aren't you the one who saved the girl? Yes, and I have her in a safe place. She's all right. I want to see her. You can if you like. Uh, she's in a friend of mine's studio. Hello there. Time for Two Truths and a Lie, in which I will tell you two truths and one lie about this film. You must guess the lie. First, this is the first of three different Sister Street Fighter films. Second, Sonny Chiba had black belts in four different martial arts. Third, Etsuo Shiomi is an Ikebana flower arrangement artist. There you have it. We'll tell you the lie by the end of the film. Good luck. I saw him. He was sneaking into Koki Saki's house to search for evidence. He was very dangerous. You could have called the police. He said there was no time. This was our only opportunity to act. He took it. We knew they received a large shipment. If we could find it, we could break the ring, he said. He decided to take the risk. down tonight. Maybe you'd rather watch a cop show on television. Or do you find them too violent? 
Is that what's the matter? This should be worth watching. <laughs> I don't know where. Oh, here. This belongs to your brother. I found it was on the floor. the girl Sunny brought here. You're wearing shoes. That isn't done in here. We'll get her. Stop! You can't go in there. Get out of the way! Thank <laughs> you. 
nicht. me how I can. It's my turn to repay your brother for all he has done. You mean it? I do, Tina. I'm willing to do anything you ask. Really? I owe that much. Actually, I owe him my life, and that's not all. If it weren't for him, I would have died. I was his student. He taught me all the karate I know. You're good, I know that. And I can use a good fight. You can count on me, Tina. About the sister of Lee Long, what have you to report? Good question. No sign of the bitch anywhere. No show. For all we know, she's holed up in the Shorinji Gymnasium. Go and look. Fanny must have talked, and she knows too much about us. Now you've got to kill Tina. With pleasure. You've wasted a lot of time, Kaki. I don't think much of your judgment. Why use these amateurs when you have me? These are the greatest. They're my collection of killers. It's my only hobby, one might say. I don't like racehorses, so I keep killers. <laughs> this is my private zoo. It amuses me. It's as much fun as a carload of gorillas. <laughs> you mean you think that I'm a gorilla like the rest of them? <laughs> You win. 
I'm impressed. You're goddamn good after all. <laughs> With my bare hands, I once was able to chop down 40 bulls. Hammerhead, you're the kind of man I need. You'll be able to work as a right-hand man. You will have your own place and a gym you'll be proud of, too. It's a deal. I'll lay down my life for you. Just say the word. Mm-hmm. Some walking around cash. Thank you. Now tell me what you want done. Ah. I think you might enjoy my experiment. This lamp, for example. It enables me to follow everything that happens in any part of the house. It's radioactivated. What you see here is our underground laboratory, so to speak. This man you see is the subject of a highly enlightened experiment. He's been injected with various drugs. It's not too easy to kill a man with only heroin. So I have bit by bit added other drugs, increasing the dose with each injection. Immensely long. You know him, then. <laughs> I forgot to be sure he's one of the Shorinji pupils, perhaps the best. But now, with his stomach full of opium extracts, he's little more than a vegetable. <laughs> ah, see, what more can we ask than for a victim to walk right into our trap? well to come. I am ahead and pleased that you're here. die soon. You should know that your brother's alive, though I wouldn't say he's exactly well. They reduced Lee Long to an organism, a vegetable. along in short order, <laughs> a true champion. She wasn't up to my class. Some shark has a full stomach by now. Ah. And now, sir, shall we talk of the new gym? You shall have it. You're going to be rolling in dough soon. I'll show you. 
Look around you. These hair pieces are imported especially from Hong Kong. They're worth a fortune. These wigs? <laughs> a wig, yes, that is drenched in heroin. Our laboratory impregnates each wig. Clever, huh? These wigs are worth their weight in gold. They're going to make us very rich. <laughs> very clever. Master, one second. There's a man here. He wants to talk with Li Long. What shall I do? Master Cocky, please. Can't I talk with the kid? Can't you have mercy on him, Master? He doesn't ask for mercy. You pleaded with me to let him live. I've granted you this favor, haven't I? Yes. I beg once again. Only let me give him these cookies. His aunt made them for the boy. You see? Tino will save you. <laughs> Take his place and replace Lee Long. Master, please don't fill his innocent days with poison. Please, Master. Hero and kill. You want your niece and nephew to live? Don't try to betray me again. Get out! Hello there. Time for some words about some of the cast and crew of tonight's film, Sister Street Fighter. The director of this film, Kazuhiko Yamaguchi, directed many martial arts films and crime films such as Tokyo Bad Girls. And he directed some of the sequels to this film as well. Many films starring Sonny Chiba and Etsuo uh, Shihomi. And speaking of Etsuo Shihomi, who plays Lee, the lead, the sister street fighter, if you will, she was in Bullet Train. She had a minor role in that. This is an excellent Japanese kind of disaster movie about a runaway train train. Uh, she was also in Karate Bear Fighter, uh, along with Sonny Chiba, who I'll get to in a moment. And she was also in Message from Space, Legend of the Eight Samurai, and many other fine films. Now, Sonny Chiba, also known as Shinichi Chiba, his true name, uh, he was in Invasion of the Neptune Men. He was in Bullet Train. He plays actually the conductor of the Bullet Train in that film. The Golden Bat, a wonderful Japanese superhero movie. Uh, Street Fighter, of course, one of his most famous roles. Wolf Guy, a bizarre film about a werewolf detective thing. I highly recommend you see it. It is a strange movie indeed. Uh, the Bushido Blade, Battle Royale Part 2, and of course, Kill Bill Volumes 1 and 2. He's well known here in the United States for those films.
Now, Asao Uchida, he plays Tetsuo. He was in Lone Wolf and Cub in Baby Cart and Peril, and also in Lone Wolf and Cub in The Sword of Vengeance, some excellent samurai movies. And he was also in The Return of Daimajin, an excellent kaiju film. Now, Binamatsu, he plays Shigatomi. Uh, he was in The Bad News Bears Go to Japan. Yes, believe it or not, he was. And he was also in The Magic Serpent, uh, Lone Wolf and Cub, another Lone Wolf and Cub film. He was in uh, Baby Cart in the Land of Demons. Those films have such wonderful names. Now, the editor of this film is Omasu Tanaka, and he produced two amazing Japanese disaster films. Uh, the Prophecies of Nostradamus, which is a bizarre film that I highly recommend. Also, Submersion of Japan, which is a fun disaster movie. Uh, he also produced and edited a 1980 television movie version of Tomb of Dracula in Japan. He was an editor on Wolf Guy with Sonny Chiba. Also, the editor of Golgo 13, another Sonny Chiba film based on the popular manga comic of the same name. Uh, he, he also did A Female Prison Scorpion, uh, Jailhouse 41, and Beast Stable, these famous uh, female prisoner movies. And he also edited, did some edits, although he is uncredited, on The Green Slime, a fun science fiction film. I highly suggest you track that down as well. We hope you are enjoying the film. We'll get right back to it after this word from our sponsor. Every gusher's piece is bursting with fruity juice. Let's go! <laughs> gushers, taste the blast. is alive? Are you certain? Hammerhead, you're caught. 
corpse has just wrecked one of my warehouses. You said she was dead. You lied to me. But it can't be true. You fool! She's not only alive, she burned one of my trucks. Master, I ask one more chance. Tina Long is working hand in hand with Shorinji. I'll crush him. I'll crush them both, I swear. You'll soon have seen the last of Tina Long. <laughs> Master Shorinji, two girl criminals are hiding under your roof. And we want them. I'm afraid I don't understand. We want Lee Long and Emi Kawasaki. We know they're here. You and your fine talk about the spirits. Well, I tell you, it's a lot of crap. Yeah. You're a man, and yet you use these hoodlum girls to fight for you. You keep a civil tongue. <laughs> man, ballless wonders. Huh? A lot of Boy Scouts you are. If you refuse to hand over the two girls, you will pay. Pull it. Talk to me, you cowards. Go back. I'll handle this. You're without honor. You deserve only our contempt, you gangsters. What? your gang. You can tell Cocky we're ready. Sonny, I deplore violence, but... Hammerhead is indisposed at present. <laughs> you will do our killing now. Why me? You surely can't ask me to do this, Master. I beg you not to. I swear she'll return to Hong Kong. Please, Master. She's over at Chorinji's place. Here. Yeah. You'll telephone her. She's dangerous. She knows too much, too much to let her live. Here. Don't make me bury my own niece. You've destroyed Lee Long and now you're asking me to? No, I won't do it. You can kill me. Spare her and kill me. Shut up, Shaw! Don't tell me that you won't do it. <laughs> This spectacle will change your idiot mind, I think. My 
own daughter. Brandy. Brandy. Let her go. Stop it! Let her out of the water! Oh, Father, help me! Don't do this to the poor girl! Please, Master, don't do it! Stop it! Oh, I've just talked to your brother. He's been released, yes. He asked me to have you come here. Come now. To the ruined factory. He's waiting. Yes. As soon as you can. Now? Yes, Uncle. I'm going right now. Wait there. Sprung for you, Tina.
anything to you? No. She left the gym without a word. It's very strange. Where could she have gone? Hmm. Papa! Randy, what happened? Tina has disappeared. Do you know where she is? Tina? Yes. Tina. Why do you ask me this? Don't ask me, I don't know. You look so strange. What happened to you? Nothing at all. Stop asking questions. <laughs> What's wrong? organization. I was in trouble. I had to borrow money. In return, he made me help the gang. Where is Lee? Where is my brother? Tell me. Kaki is your brother. In his cellar. Cellar? Hey everybody, summer's here, and you know what that means. It means the sun is out. So if you're working out down by the pool with the other members of your martial arts army, or strolling along the waterfront contemplating revenge for your lost brother, or fighting a martial arts master down at the beach, be sure to protect your eyes from the glare of the sun and, well, other dangers. 
Yes, be sure to wear those swanky sunglasses, get a hat that covers your eyes to protect you from glare and other nasty things, or wear a basket on your head, which will cover your eyes, or double as a hamper to bring your wet stuff back from the beach. Yes, wear sunscreen. Well, not that much, but you get the idea. Have a great summer, everybody. going to give us a sermon, is he? You'll do fine. I'm sure these are armor piercing. But will they pierce Lee Long? <laughs> Can your spikes pierce Lee Long's eyes? <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
this for nothing. I promise. I've uncovered their secret routes. I can break the ring. That's great. Great. So our invincible little tigress has reached the end of the line. You will now enjoy the same fate as all my enemies. Now, my dear, I will enjoy the pure pleasure of sending you to hell. You may join your brother.
you want. Kaki, we're going to take you. You ask for it, you'll all be killed. You shall die. Go and get them.
see who's best man now.
We hope you have enjoyed tonight's film, Sister Street Fighter. Please feel free to email us your comments about it. Also be sure to check out our blog, Facebook fan page, Twitter feed, weirdorama.com, and our Patreon page if you are feeling generous. The lie, this is not the first of three Sister Street Fighter films. It's the first of four of them. You have Sister Street Fighter, the return of the Sister Street Fighter, Sister Street Fighter hanging by a thread, and Sister Street Fighter fifth level fist. Mouthful. So, for all of us at Weirdo Rama, this is Victor Von Psychotron telling all of you to stay weird. <laughs>